Hi, boys and girls. I am so glad to see you today at Early Childhood. I love meeting you here every week. And today we have a new friend that hasn't been here before. Can you see, it, see her anywhere? Oh yeah, here she is. This is Skeeter. She's actually Pastor Jimmy and Sue Ann and Jackson and Maddox puppy. But we're staying at their house for a little while, so now she gets to come and be in our video and gets to say hi to all of you. Can you wave at her? Look at all those people waving at you, Skeeter. Can you wave back? She says, hi, everybody. I'm glad Skeeter got to come, but I'm gonna let her go now so we can get back to the important things we need to do, okay? Just a minute. Well, boys and girls, we're gonna start out again today with some special singing, a wonderful story from God's Word and worshiping Jesus. Are you ready to do that? You might need to stand. All right, everybody ready? Okay, let's worship. My friend forever When I get 
about your shoulders? Can you point to your knees and your toes? Awesome, let's do it together. My head and shoulders, knees and toes. He loves everything about me. My eyes and ears and mouth and nose. He loves everything about me. My head and shoulders, knees and toes. He loves everything about me. My eyes and ears and mouth and nose. He loves everything about me. Everybody say, I've got a friend, a friend in Jesus. He loves everything about me. I've got a friend, a friend in Jesus. He loves everything about me. Oh, I've got a friend, a friend in Jesus. He loves everything about me. Loves me. I've got a friend, a friend in Jesus. He loves everything about me. Yeah. Oh 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 oh. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through who? Oz got a Bible story for me and you. <gasps> Hola, friends. I'm Luis the Handyman, just out here on this beautiful day using power tools. <laughs> I love that. With the press of a button, I can... Ooh, have all the power! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> but today's story is about the one who has the most amazing out of this world power. <gasps> Do you know who it is? Do you want to help me build this story? Great! Let's put it on the story fence. Hammers up, little builders. Ready? Uno, dos, tres, hammer! Great job, little helpers. You can put your hammers down. Now we just need our story tools. Yep, we have everything we need. Okay, so like I said, today's true story from the Bible is about someone who has the most amazing out of this world power. Hmm, now I wonder, what kind of power we have. Like, do you think we could stop the sun from shining in the sky? Huh, let's try. Everyone yell, stop, sun, stop. Ready? Stop, sun, stop. Did we stop it? No. <laughs> well, we don't have the power to stop the sun. Hmm. Do you think we have the power to make it rain? Huh. Let's try. Everybody's gonna make it rain on the count of three. Ready? One, two, three, rain! Okay, stop. Look. Is it raining? Uh, no. <laughs> Do we have the power to make it rain? No, we don't have the power, but... There is someone amazing who does. Do you know who it is? Yep, it's Jesus. <laughs> One night, Jesus and his friends were on a boat out on the sea, and Jesus went to take a nap. All of a sudden, a huge storm came up. Ooh, ooh, can you make it sound like a storm? Now, rub your hands together like this. Do you hear the rain? Oh, and then it started to rain harder. Now, pat your legs, everyone. And harder. Pat faster. And harder. And Jesus' friends were scared. Now, show me your scared face. <laughs> It was raining and thundering and lightning. <sighs> and the boat was rocking back and forth. Ooh, can you rock back and forth with me? Oh, whoa. Ooh. So Jesus' friends woke him up. Help, Jesus, help, they said. And 
guess what? Jesus stood up in the boat and he looked at the wind and at the waves and he told them to stop. And the storm stopped. Jesus had the power to stop a storm. His friends were like, wow! Can you say that with me? Wow! Yes, they were amazed because Jesus, God's son, is out of this world amazing! Hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who is amazing? Jesus is amazing. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who is amazing? Jesus is amazing. <laughs> That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Adios. See you next time. Welcome back, boys and girls. Oh, how I love to hear you sing. And I love worshiping Jesus together with you. Wasn't our story exciting today? Our story was about someone who is very powerful. Can you remember his name? I'll bet you can. What was his name? Yes, Jesus. Jesus is so powerful. He can do many things that you and I can't do. And we heard about one of those in today's true story from the Bible, didn't we? I wish we were in the same room so that you could tell me the story you just heard. But since we aren't, I will tell you the story again, okay? Because I love to hear it. Jesus was with his disciples in a boat out on the lake. And all of a sudden, a big storm came up and the boat started to rock and the rain started coming down and the wind was blowing and the water was coming up over the sides of the boat. The disciples were pretty frightened because they couldn't do anything about this big storm that came. But was Jesus afraid? No, he wasn't afraid because he knew that he had more power than that storm. And so Jesus just very calmly said to the wind and the waves and the rain, peace be still. And all of a sudden it stopped raining and the wind stopped blowing and the boat wasn't rocking because Jesus was so powerful that even the storm have to do what he tells them. You and I can't do that, but Jesus can. Isn't that awesome? And that means that we can trust him, can't we? Because he's not only loves us, but he's so powerful, he can help us and he will. We're gonna do our memory verse and then we're gonna talk to Jesus. So I want you to get your hearts and minds ready while we say our memory verse, okay? Are you ready? Everyone who heard him was amazed. Luke 2, 47. Let's try it one more time, ready? Everyone who heard him were amazed. Luke 2, 47. Awesome. Because Jesus is so awesome and so powerful, he deserves our praise and our worship, and we're gonna, we're gonna praise him in prayer right now, okay? So you do what you need to do to get ready. Hold your hands if you need to. Find where you need to sit. And we're gonna focus our minds and our thoughts on Jesus, okay? Jesus, we are so grateful that you love us, that you care about us. And we're also so thankful that you are so powerful that you can do whatever needs to be done for our good. We worship you and we praise you and we thank you, amen. Good job, boys and girls. It's time for us to say goodbye again. We have another wonderful week ahead of us. Let's serve and worship and praise Jesus this week, okay? All right, you have a wonderful week. Bye-bye.